So could the Brooklyn Nets be trading away Nick Claxton to the Los Angeles Lakers this 2024 NBA offseason? Well, here on the screen is a trade proposal or a trade idea from fadeawayworld.net. The link to this article is down below in case you want to check out the entire thing for yourself. But this trade would see the Los Angeles Lakers receiving Nick Claxton and the Brooklyn Nets receiving Rui Hachimura, Jalen hood Shafino, a 2024 NBA draft pick that is number 17 overall, and a 2026 first-round pick swap from the Los Angeles Lakers. So obviously with the, with the 2024 NBA draft uh, having taken place a couple weeks ago now, uh, that draft pick would have to be a future draft pick, but uh, still the same applies. I think the winner of this deal probably has to be the Los Angeles Lakers as they are, as they are getting back the best player without a doubt in Nick Claxton. Uh, the Lakers sort of had a tough offseason so far. Uh, LeBron James took a little bit less on his contract to bring in players you know, like a DeMar DeRozan or like a Paul George, which obviously did not happen. So perhaps the next move for the Lakers would be to explore the trade market. And with the Brooklyn Nets sort of heading into more of a rebuild uh, following the following the uh, New York Knicks, uh, Mikhail Bridges trade a couple weeks ago now, Nick Claxton's a player that could definitely be had at a reasonable price, I would imagine. So if you are the Lakers, you're getting back the best player in this deal, having a front court of, you know, for the future and for the present as well of Nick Claxton and Anthony Davis is definitely one of the best in the entire NBA. And I think that Nick Claxton helps his team win now. While LeBron James is still, you know, playing at a very high level when his time in the NBA is probably pretty numbered at this point. So I think if you're the Lakers, there's a little bit more pressure for them to add a player or two to the roster uh, that can help them win now. And if that's going to cost them a couple of good, you know, solid rotational pieces like Jalen hood Shafino and Rui Hachimura, as well as some draft capital, you probably have to pull the trigger on a deal of this magnitude. Now, if you are the Brooklyn Nets, you're getting back two contracts, which you, which you could definitely flip down the road. Uh, but this makes the money work, obviously. But more importantly, you're getting back some future draft capital from a team in Los Angeles that is a little bit up there in age that wants to win now. And if that draft pick is, for example, in 2029, for instance, that could be a lottery pick at that point in time. So, uh, you know, leave your thoughts down below as always. But I think the winner of this deal probably has to be the Los Angeles Lakers. But as always, leave your thoughts down below.